Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Far Cry 6. I'm your host, Colors Fade. It's episode 6. And we're on our way down to this portion of the map to pick up all of these various crates before we head over here and start doing story missions again. So there's a bunch of crates that were made available to us. Seems only fitting that we should come down here and start grabbing them. So there's the first one right there. Danny's tough if she can get through a pallet with a a knife. The rioter vest. Ooh. Let's see what that's all about. Slightly improved soft target blast and armor piercing is what we're wearing, and the rioter vest does improves armor piercing defense. So, what is this? Interesting. All right, the next one is over here. Across the road. Come on, croc. Oh, it's up there. Where we were dealing with the coyotes last time. Coyote. Me meep. Coming after you. Oh, and there goes one right there. Two of them. Wapo. The thing to do right here, actually, is to swap this out for this shotgun. Either one of these shotguns, but we'll use the overclock one. This one's... Yeah, let's use that one. These are really good against animals. That's the number one thing. You sucker. I don't know that Guapo's gonna do anything for me. I'm just grabbing that damaged meat is all, but... Guapo, so far I'm not really impressed with you. You just do a lot of hissing. What kind of round standard shells for these? Okay. We have to be able to build so that we can start using shot and other things. This guy here will have some stuff for us. He'll tell us about some kind of operation going Over on. Here. What do you know? Danny, we've been tailing a convoy that circles near Lanzas Altas Ridge. Time for a guerrilla like you to take it out. Hey, thanks. Convoys are kind of the least fun of all the various random missions they'll give you. I love it when they give me things like ambushes. More pallet blocks. Alright. Get that out of the way. Let it fall out of the way there. Okay. We get the rioter gloves. Which are going to do what for us? Probably. Is it armor piercing again? Again, we don't use those because... Flying vi <laughs> improves weapon damage against flying vehicles. Oh, wow. Anti-air. That's interesting. Okay. Oh, and then what is that? There's a chicken up there. You can see the dot there. We got to go over there anyway. That's it. But look at on the, uh, on the map. It was a different thing. Yeah, you can see it. See that little icon there? On the right, near the W, we're getting close to it. That is for a rooster. If I'm not mistaken. You can collect a bunch of different roosters. What's going on here? Papo, go. What are we looking at here, little roosters? Papo, move. Papo, where are you? Ooh, you are a lousy, a lousy assistant. <laughs> so that's our first Rupert rooster. There's 19 to get. I never did go get all of them before, so it might be fun to do. Oh, and there we go. We can get down here. So this is, this is just like a puzzle from Far Cry 3. There's an island in Far Cry 3 that you cannot physically climb up to. The only way to get to it is to take a hang glider to it. It's got a relic on top. This instead, we get this, so. Huh. 
And if you adjust your flight path just right, you end up with it. Awesome. What do we get for that? Supremo Bond. Okay. Look at how beautiful that is. Gorilla Paradise. All right. Now, there's one over there. Libertad Crate there. And then this is a facility up here. Where is it? It's down there. Hmm. Okay. We're going to have to swim, which means we're probably going to get eaten. All right, Danny, you slow swimmer. You can get equipment that will allow you to breathe underwater longer, but I don't think there's any equipment that actually makes you swim faster. What are we looking at over here? This looks pretty. Lots of little crabs. Okay, cool. Oh, we just caught the ledge. That was wonderful. That's a pair of pants. The scrounger jeans. That should help you with acquiring stuff. This improves armor piercing damage, but the scrounger ones improves repair tool power. Automatically repairs vehicles when inside and can repair auto turrets. Weird. I wouldn't affect I wouldn't expect that to be under something called scrounger, but so be it. There's Wapo in his natural environment. There's a Libertad crate where? Up there. Oh. How are we gonna get up there, Wapo? <laughs> Let's go see if we can find our way up there. Oh, there we can. Right over here. There we go. And it's going to be right up there. What a pretty island. It's just a gorgeous setting for this game. It's so much more inspiring than... Far Cry 4 or Montana. Montana was nice, though. As a person who grew up in North North Idaho, um, I have a lot of appreciation for Montana. Basically, where that game, where Far Cry 5 takes place, looks a lot like where I grew up. So, The Fuego which is improves fire defense, but when you have gloves that automatically put out the fire, I don't see a lot of point in having those. So, Wapo, where is our next one? It's over here. To our left. Wapo. You stud. Okay, hold on. Let's go back down here. We've... We've mostly collected items. We haven't collected a lot, but I want to see what we're looking at for upgrading this weapon. What's it going to cost to get us a three times scope? We need one more gunpowder. Okay, and then what do we need for a canted sight? One more gunpowder and a bunch of durable seals. Okay. All right. Well, at least lets us know what we can do. Getting a three times scope on my main assault weapon is always a, a good goal. It's a big deal. So there's another one of those. I don't. Can we get there from here? Or do we need the squirrel suit? Hmm. We might need the squirrel suit for that one. So I'm not sure we can get up there. Yep. Not there. I'm not sure there's any way around this thing. That looks like it might be. Can we crawl up that? Nope. Okay. Nope. There's going to be no crawling up this. Is there? We're going to need a squirrel suit to get to it. Okay. All right. We will leave you for another day. Oh boy, we there's a ledge there and we just missed it. Okay. 
What other ones are we looking at down? There's two down here, and then there's these things. Let's go get involved. Oh. Los Banditos update their awaiting orders, so we can go do that at any point in time. I should do Danny's workout. I'd be in I'd be in shape in no time. Climbing, running, jumping, parkour. Weather station. What is this place? Hey Clara. Know of any reason the military would take over a weather station? You're in the west, right? I've been wondering about that place myself. See if you can find a computer. They must be logging whatever they're up to. Sure. I'll take a look around. This has a security system and it's inside the building. And getting up there, there's the sniper. Okay, shotgun's gotta go. Back to the sniper rifle. Oh. Dang it. Okay, he's down. Let's watch him run out and make sure nobody goes up and gets him. And let's get rid of Guapo, because... Yep, let's make... Uh-oh. That's no good. That's what's bad about not having... I should have changed the rounds on that, I, I guess. I was going to say, that's what's bad about not having... A gun, a sniper rifle that can headshot somebody is. If you can't get him in one shot, then it can cause people to be alerted. To your presence, which is a bad Got to be careful here. So if we hear the siren go off, we might just want to leave this one for now. But well no, we're a gorilla. We just fight our way. But I know it's inside. Yep, and that's how you know. It's got that. It's inside somewhere, and I can't remember where it's inside. If it's inside that building or inside this building. So. I hear it. It's right there. Is this the only alarm? Yep, all alarms disabled. Okay. Let's kill these guys then. Let's just take them out, shall we? I sense one walking in behind me. That's when I wish I had... Some, some mines. He couldn't believe what he saw. But by the time he couldn't believe it, it was too late. Silence is getting hot, so. Oh, left or right there. <laughs> She's just giving us the 
She's giving us the side eye. This is one of the ones that always ends up with reinforcements for me. I never manage to kill everybody before they get to that alarm, but... This time, I remembered that there was an alarm. And it was inside the building. And that's it. That's how you get the music to stop. <laughs> Castillo's marching bands. Yeah, so if you see those... If you see those green lights on the outside of the building, but they don't go down to a pole that has an actual security system attached to it, then that means the security system is inside the building. So I need to make sure that I'm aware of that. There's a ton of stuff to pick up here. There's also, we get a helicopter now. New weapons available at Juan's arms because we've leveled up. And if you deface these posters, that helps. Wow, that's what you get. <laughs> See, I, I just love... Danny's so great. Female Danny is the best. We'll go around here and pick up all the stuff. Because this will help us with all our bandito operations. Let's see. In this building somewhere, there's a couple of things. So what do we have? We got... Medicine... That's on the outside. Where is everything? There we go. Is it it's so it's up there? Okay. Somehow I missed it. Not surprising. What did I miss up here? Oh, this is the Recharge gizmos thing. I don't care about that. I want this other one. The FND crate. That's what we want. That's where the good stuff is. And there's our gunpowder. Now we can get our three times scope. And there's another one up here. It's actually down. That's right. There is a downstairs to this place. Right over here. Little hidden parts of the island. Bunkers and such. Where are you, little bunker? You get the key for succeeding F and D crate what's that one going to be and it's the M133 shotgun which if you didn't have a shotgun like I have with the spaz 12 because it's an overclocked one because I got it from a previous th playthrough then that would be your first I think that would be your first... No, it's your second shotgun. There's that gold one that's your first one. So your second shotgun... Amir. He's got Hola. something for us. Elvis Carvalho won't leave me alone. Keep saying he needs help with some errands. Can you get him off my back? Thanks. I suppose I can. There's a big old gasoline can up here in the road. Cars. Fantastic. She's got your goods here. So, so this stuff, I wouldn't necessarily trade in and tell you no. Um, for sure what kind of meals you want to do later on. To add buffs, because there are some really nice buffs. I am a savvy spender. That's right. Very good with my money. Perks of knowing how to adult. 
All right, let's go spin this over here. Let's take the primary weapon. Take this, put a three times optical scope on there. That one, very nice. So now all we need is a canted scope and we can't get there yet. We're gonna need two gunpowders and five more durable seals. And then the pointer just allows, it's a laser pointer and it improves bullet spread when firing from the hip. So greatly reduces bullet spread when firing from the hip. Like to have those, those are always nice. On your assault weapons. So. All right, that was fun. Now what do we have? Oh yeah, and we still have the rest of these. There's a key cryptogram chest over here. So let's head straight on out. Danny never sleeps. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a second. Where was that one? In the middle of the water. That's the one in the middle of the water. <laughs> yeah. We know how to do this. All right. Restricted airspace. Where is that thing? Right there. Yeah. What we can do. Let's see what's down on this thing. Control. That's right. Remember, there's only so many ways to get on this darn island, so... We'll do it this way. I love this kind of stuff. I love it. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. It's that island over there I gotta be on? Oh, for heaven's sake. Okay. I missed it. Anti-aircraft at make the skies dangerous. Yeah, that's why you want to take those things out. Right over here. Drop her down. Boink. Now what am I looking at? It's like right on this ledge, isn't it? Okay, right there. There we go. Hazmat gloves. Those are for poison, I assume. We'll always look at it. Yep, improves poison defense. Can be very useful in certain situations. Now, next is right there. That libertate crate to the cell. So let's go dive here. Uh oh, there's a question mark. Okay, can I change this standard rounds? I can't. This one's stuck. Standard round did that though. That works. What am I looking at over here? Oh. Oh, never mind. That. Never mind. I'm thinking of a different location. Okay. Sometimes some of these locations bleed into each other, but... What do we have here? Extreme fishing. An angelfish fishing spot revealed. Ooh. Okay. We can handle that now. Let's walk down the coast on a nice night. How is this? Gotta dig this, don't you? There's the crabs. Crunch, crunch under your feet. It's always fun. I don't have a huge urge to run all the time in this game because it's so damn beautiful. And Maybe this is what happens to you when you become an old gamer and you realize your time is running out. You just want to enjoy everything a little bit more. Supremo Bond. Okay. That's cool. Now, the crypto game chest, the last thing here. I mean, this is just so pretty. So cool. Comes an airplane. It's one of the things they did with this game is they made it way harder. 
to shoot aircraft out of the sky because they want you to use your Supremo. They want you to use your backpack. Which is totally understandable. If you're going to invent something new for the game, you got to give players a reason to use it. All right. That doesn't sound good. What am I listening to? Oh, what? What do we have here? Oh. Who's that alligator? Guapo? You're coming back, buddy. This place is a mess. He's killing someone. That's going to call in all of the amigos here. There's a question mark down there too. That's that's what we're waiting for. Oh look. Oh jeez. Yep. There we go. Shit. Okay, got him. Got him. We got a barking dog. Okay. Now we, I think we're safe, and there's a supply drop over here. So, like I said, I'm still getting lucky with these. It's kind of amazing. This has not happened the first two times I played the game. I'm wondering. I haven't seen very many patches for the game, so I'm wondering if that's what it is. Is did they do this in a patch? But whatever the result. I'll take it. That's been a lot of fun. And I got another gunpowder. That's awesome. So. And a Supremo Bond. Oh, and there's what? There's a spray paint can over here? Yeah, it's up in that building. Okay. Give me this. Spray paint. Yep. Well, in that case... Guapo, I need you to be on the high alert, buddy. If another crocodile comes along, you gotta, like, engage him. Another fishing spot. Barracuda hunting spot. Ooh. Nice. Okay, now let's go see if we can solve this crypto game. Before we're so rudely interrupted. Let's see. Can I get around and... I can't. Let's see if I can get in there. Alright, so what do we have? Find the remaining hint and cram crypto game charts. There's a coyote and a pig and do we have anything around here that's pointing us in the right direction hmm okay so to get in here you gotta do this wapo so usually within sight of a cryptogram chest there is some kind of piece of paint or something somewhere that suggests to you which direction you need to go but it's dark out so I'm having a little bit of a hard time seeing things is 
It's not entirely sure where it could be. What do we have down here? We got a guy fishing at night. Is there anything on top of a roof? There's also that roof over there. Presidente Castillo's a liar. Paraíso perdido. I know he's a liar. We're gonna get him. Trust me. Yeah, I don't really see anything over here that could help us. So I'm guessing it's not over here. If it was daytime, we'd have an easier time of seeing where it was from. What about... There's... Here we go. What do we got here? The first key is in this direction. Okay. It's probably out on that little island then, huh? Question is, where is the second one going to be? There's one. That's the pig. There's more going this way. Okay. Well then. We just have to trust that this is the right way. Blue on blue. Wapa, what are you finding there, buddy? He's going after something. Ooh, you got a croc? Oh. Wapa, where are you heading? You... I'm trying not to. What? Yeah, all you guys are toast. Uh-oh, we got... Who else? Okay. Oh, and we still have that crocodile way down there. See, you start to try to engage the wildlife, and that's what happens. I can hear the tinkling sound. It's over here. There we go. Tinkling sound leads us to it. But not before we had to fire a few bullets, huh, Guapo? Oh, we have a piece of one. He's stuck in the ground. Ah, I can't get him. He's in the ground. Okay. We gotta leave him alone. Guapo. These people are partying. They're having a good time because all the crocodiles are dead now. Or so they think. Cryptogram chest. What do we get for that? It was the Rioter Boots Mark II. Those are going to be Scrounger Shoes, Rioter Boots Mark II. Greatly improves armor piercing round defense. Slightly impairs mood speed. That's what I like. So those things are what I like to start doing on the second group here. My second group. My first group is what I call my most common loadout. It's the thing that I use when I'm traversing the world and I can take down an outpost with it if I need to and I can shoot everybody. The group after that is generally the 
heavy heavy weapons and heavy defense version of that it's for when you're using number one trying to sneak around and things go to hell and everything starts to get very there's an intense firefight then i go to number two number three is one i usually set up for traversing the landscape at night and dealing with the animals so it's going to have a shotgun and it's got a different backpack and then the fourth one as i said in one of the earlier playthroughs is emp it's for taking out all the alarms so i usually walk into an outpost with loadout number four take out all the alarms and then switch to one and if things go really crazy if i can't get the alarms done and they start calling in reinforcements then we switch over to loadout number two so so for loadout number two we want the things that are going to give us the most defense, armor piercing defense, and what do we have here? Soft target blanks and armor piercing defense. That improves armor piercing defense, but this also improves blast and soft target, so that's why we'll keep that there. So this is a much more defensive set, and then I need some kind of thing that improves throwing knife. That's greatly improves general defense while sprinting. Improves the weapon damage against flying vehicles. Improves sidearm ammo. Improves move speed while weapons are holstered. Improves poison defense. Nope. So I'd probably rather have this general defense while sprinting. So this is our heavy set. And then also there should be one. Soft target blast defense. Yep. That you, if you really want to, you can switch it up with the armor piercing stuff. But this is our general defense one. It's going to have this and this and a shotgun. So yeah, this is used for occasionally if we need to. What I, what I really end up doing with this is assault rifle, some kind of resolver or light machine gun, and then a mortar. <laughs> but, but we're not there yet, so... Punk. Run. If I can remember what I'm doing here. All right. Let's go back to... You have to change this every time. I like single shot. Oh, and... Let's see. Soft target for rounds for right now. Until such time as we start to get... Into it. These guys are gonna have to fight. Okay, here we go. So we got three punks. Oh, jeez. Here comes a helicopter. It's not. Yeah, go get him. Good. That's what I needed. Where's the next guy? Right there. He's got his helmet on, so that's why the soft target rounds didn't do anything. So we'll take him out that way instead. Okay, now. Let's figure out where we're going and what we're doing. So everything has been cleared here. And we just need to make our way over to here. Okay. If we can get something in the water, right up here is dockside pickup. Okay, let's go there. We want to basically go north and northeast, like right there. That'd be great. Let's go this way. Wapo. Soft target rounds, good against animals. I'll get you You're done. Alright. As the sun comes up on our adventure, we will go get ourselves a boat and get over to the next location where we can do story mission. That is what the one of the one of the things the game does really well is sound. So if you're using silenced weapons, yeah. 
then enemies, soldiers, soldados won't show up as regular. Guapo challenge update. Okay. He killed somebody. That's nice. Yeah, so if you're using noisy weapons, then soldados show up all over the place. They're like, oh, heck yeah. But if you're not using noisy weapons, if you're using silenced weapons, then they tend not to show up, which is really nice. It's a, it's just a nice touch. I'm not going to have him hanging out with us while we go do this. This is the song. Oh, this song is so good. I wish it could just be like the only song that played on the radio. This is great. I love that song. La Rubia is the name of it. You can find it on YouTube. She's, it's a fantastic song. It's just a great Latin pop song. And I generally don't like pop music, but I love that song. I want to figure out a way to mod my game so that that's the only song that plays when I get in a car or, or a boat or anything. Just a jet ski. Play that song. All right, where are we at? We're close. That's the crate. And then we have the Sanchez farm. Okay. Sanchez. That is the name of a guy who was a really good bud of mine when I was on active duty in the Air Force. Sanchez was a, an awesome dude. One of my lasting memories is when we were doing the Super Bowl. This was the this was one of the Cowboys versus the Buffalo Bills Super Bowls way back in the nineties. It was the one where it was the one where the Cowboys steamrolled him. And Sanchez took over the we were at somebody's house off base. Sanchez took over the kitchen. He's like, I'm making homemade tortillas. Carlos, Stand it's back. Danny. Danny from Libertad. I know. You think I forgot or something? No, I just didn't know it. Forget it. I'm coming up on some of Castillo's poison. Look for yellow containers. Crop dusters and fumigators got the poison too. Okay, I'm on it. Well then, do we have anywhere where we can do a little reconnaissance here? What do we have? There is bulletproof alarm. But okay, so there's the first one, bulletproof alarm. Yep. And what's interesting is they'll say bulletproof alarm, but I still think you can shoot a lot of them. If those animals got out, there would be real chaos. Yes, there'd be a distraction, and there's a that gate, that alarm. Where's that go to? That tower. That I've tried to get up that tower before and you get seen. So it's not it's not really constructed really well. The thing to do is gonna be to shoot that alarm off before we get over there. Hmm, where is she gonna go? Weak against soft target rounds, yeah, because she's got her head exposed. So does that guy. And remember to blow a lot of stuff up. Okay. I got an idea. 
I got an idea. I'm not using much on the way here, am I? Nope. Equip that set. Let's get this equipped. And then, yep, you're going to want that for silence. You're never going to use that weapon. That's what the thing is. That's kind of like a waste of time. Okay. Because there's that poison over there and it's not open and it will screw up our day. She went around with that dog. Oh, we need this one. Anybody hear that? No? Good. That guy just moved. Oh, shit. She's right there. Dang it. I need her to keep walking. Problem is, she's got a dog with her. The alarm's been sabotaged. It's the only thing that mattered. This is another one of those fights that I frequently don't get right. Gosh darn it. Oh, I had equip the equipment to stop me from poison. Oh, that's a shame. I thought I was going to get through there without dying. That sucked. Ah. Darn it. I thought I was doing that the smart way. I should have stayed with the silenced weapon longer. Oh, crud. Okay. What am I using then? What does all this stuff do? Slightly improves soft target blast. Greatly improves move speed. Being poison increases move speed. Improves poison defense. Protects your eyes from poison. Hmm. Okay. The lock should be disabled again. And I think the alarm is still disabled. When we go back. I think. Nope. It's still active. Crud. Okay, I gotta do it all over again. That sucks. Well, all right. Take out that alarm. Yep, you do. Get this Goomba in the car. Wonder what would happen if the animals. Got the out. animals are there's what there's one in there there's one cart there there's one cart there. Would it be enough to get us in there? Hmm, okay. The lock is gone, though. That's good. Oh, you can get over the fence this way. <laughs> yeah, I see you. Oh, you don't even need to get over the fence because there's... Nobody got the alarm off. That's BS. 
BS. Oh, that's such baloney. Animals did get out eventually. That's cool. Short controlled bursts. Where's the last guy? Take that. How you like that? Fumigator dude. Dang it. Someone sees me, but I can't see them yet. Where are they? I I was in the process of killing that alarm, and I shot the guy who was running up to it. There's no way he got that thing off. That was a cheat. Where's everybody else? Oh, I got a guy riding in on a horse. He, that horse just took out that gate. That is hilarious. Well, Mierda. don't ever let them tell you that the physics in this game is real. It's kind of real. There's one guy back here and he's hiding by this helicopter. Okay, guapo. Everything went to hell. Oh, there he is. We still got one guy left. Can I get it with the armor piercing bullets? Yes. Okay. I think that's what I remember. Is that as long as it's uh, armor piercing bullets, you can get through that. So any of those ones that say they can't be shot, they can be shot. You just got to shoot them with armor piercing ones. I'm pretty sure that's the case. There's got to be somebody else here. What am I doing? I'm inside the search. Find the poison containers and tobacco arms and, the, and oh, oh, so I have to destroy them all. Oh, okay. Hostages. Hostages. Poison anyone else with that shit anymore? Okay. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. What's this gun down here do? I want to make sure on my other on my other save game I have this set up with exploding bullets, but it doesn't come with those by by default. So, what's it going to be better at shooting the PG with? Well, okay. I'm wondering what's the best thing they shoot it with. Armored person bullets or something else. Or regular rounds. That works. Because there's a bunch of them. So let's go to... I like single shot. Anything else? There's 32%. I'm guessing we got, what, 33% in each one of these locations? That's what we need to do. This might be a little longer episode because I might want to finish this. Okay. Well... That's been a right mess. 
The Supremo's ready, and where's our reload? Right there. Okay. In that case, where's the next one at? Clear the air operation. Yeah, okay. So this one, and then up here. All right. I can find poison containers and tobacco farms and all around the valley. Looks like Carlos sent me some photos on my phone. Yeah, yeah, we got rid of all that. I mean, the whole place has been laid to waste. Let's go, Guapo. The next one's this way. It's gorilla time. Take your crop duster and shove it. We have something going on down here. Not exactly sure what. What do you got for me? Hola, guerrillera! Come here! Tell me what you know. Danny, they put a fucking anti aircraft cannon on my family's land. I'll mark it on your map. Thank you. Well, that's a problem for another day. Right now. Oh, I see. You see me? Okay, so where is it? It's down the road. And that one's up there. Okay, yeah, here's the farm area. Oh, and there is an anti aircraft cannon, and it's down here. Where we actually need to go. Well, okay then. I don't think there's an alarm anywhere here. There's just the big canisters over there. You gonna show your face? I don't know how I missed him. Didn't. Oh, jeez, come on. There we go. Can I? I still can't change the rounds on this gun, can I? Okay. Let's go. I think we can take him out. There's a guy way down there, set up as a sniper. Wapo, we got some... Who's looking at us? Yes, the question you should be asking is what? For sure. Oh no. Okay. This guy's in the road. I just saw their car show up. I'm gonna get you, buddy. Anti aircraft. Where's my, where's my alligator? Might as well get this while we're here. OK, 
Okay, Guapo, where is this map? The Uranium is... Okay, a local checkpoint is vulnerable. That'd be good. Where is it? Where is it? We're right there. Okay. That's you. Okay. Let's go, Guapo. Depleted uranium, and now we have more guys coming. It's a problem for them. Oh, that's no good. Ah! Do I have anything that will work? Oh, holy hell. Oh, I didn't need to throw that extra one, did I? The anti-aircraft is down. So I'm thinking we may be able to, may be able to fly one of those planes. We're at 47%. Oh, there's a helicopter. Yeah! <gasps> That's unfortunate. Oh, man, okay. Oh, it's not an attack plane. It's a crop duster. I don't think any of these... Well, that's not necessarily true. Controlling the plane is super hard to do in this game. Now do I have anything? Yeah, it's a little it's a little janky. Okay. It's the one one of the things in the game that Far Cry 6 has improved itself as a game over every other iteration of Far Cry in so many ways, but the one thing it hasn't done is gotten better at planes. Ah. Ah. It's like my worst nightmare. Okay. Well, here's what we're going to do. Eject! down here. Oh, if we could get to the top of that tower, it'd be great. Carlos. You remember to hit those crop duster planes. Expensive as hell and the army can't replace them easy. Just in case you forgot. Why does no one just fucking text? What is this, the 90s? <laughs> okay, I got this person. Closer to earning that old man's trust. All right, let's see. Who do we have here? I don't have anything else. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Eighty-four percent. Probably gonna have to go back and blow up one of those planes, aren't I? What am I looking at here? You 
you're not doing anything. Anything? Anything else? So we just got to go get one of those planes. Ah, oh, son of a gun. Okay. Uh, oh my gosh. I don't want to drive a tractor over there. That's no good. Is there anything else that can get us over there fast? Hmm. It doesn't look like it does it. Oh, well, fine. We'll do it this way. I need a container. Here we go. F and D create. I need something that will fill up my grenades. I'm going to free you. Gracias, that gives me some... Bandito guys, I think. Okay, Guapo, we're going to leave that guy behind. You're free. Get out of here. <sighs> Do I really want to... Can I just run there faster, maybe? What's the fastest way over to that airfield? Right there. Okay, right turn. I'm just a farmer. I'm trying to get my junky wagon to the farm. I have to get my track door to the farm. Oh, brother. I might be able to run faster than this. But it's kind of comical. I mean, that's... That is the comedy of Far Cry. It's weird physics happening and... Oh, here's the convoy. It's weird physics... That happen every now and then. It's this unintentional consequences of certain things. <laughs> it's... It's driving a tractor... To perform guerrilla operations. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is too funny. I'm kind of enjoying this, actually. What? Don't let the tractor catch you, dude. That's, isn't that interesting how he breaks for the bridge? That's interesting. Wait a minute, are we going to the wrong place? I need to go to the airfield, dude. The airfield. Oh no, okay, it's going to have us turn. And the Supremo is ready. Good. Because that may be how we're going to have to destroy them. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine giving the after action report on this? So did you blow up those airplanes? Like I told you? Yes. I drove a tractor. Right to the site. I need Philly here with me, so he can rig this tractor to blow up. This is me coming down here. Okay, these guys are back already. Well, guess what? Put it away in your head. Okay, watch yourself, Danny. Who's seeing me? I'm not sure who's seeing me. I gotta kill these guys all over again. It was nice of you to try to use that flash grenade. But it's not gonna work. If they're going to blow me up, they better do it near one of these planes. Go ahead. Shoot at me. I want to see you do it. Wapo? They can air support me all they want. Got him. Okay, I don't have any grenades, though. That's a problem. Ah, 
Oh, what would it take to blow this thing up? Oh, no, that's not too bad. Okay, that's going to blow up. rifle ammo. Okay, this. Is that it? Oh, what? There's 1% left? From what? 1%? Oh, come on. 1%? You're killing me, Smalls. 1%. Is there something in here that we can use? I suppose I should go grab the parts off these planes. Is there... Was there a... There we go. There we go. <laughs> Alright, my man. That's a way to end that episode. Carlos, it's done. Good. Let's see if Napoleon El Pequeño gets the fucking message. I got more work for you. Come back to camp. Try to get lost, tourist. Wapo, you've been fun. That's a proper way to end an episode. I was hoping I'd have time to do it. We went a little long, but that's all right. Oh, geez. And there's... We're going to let the... You know what? If La Rubia was playing, I would just, I would just let the episode end with that. But since it's not, we're gonna go up here and we're gonna grab this crate and call it a day. FND crate. And it's a gunpowder. Very nice. Well, there we go. This is Castillo's world, but we're taking it over one small piece at a time. Everybody, thanks for watching. If you dig it, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Leave your questions and comments down below. Consider supporting the Patreon. You know it's in the description below. I hope you're all enjoying this crazy ass game. Because I'm just having a huge, huge amount of fun playing it. So I'll see you all next time. And until then, happy gaming, everyone. <laughs>